Do you know that 18 out of 20 people are scared of doing percentage calculations? Hi, I am Olympia Lapointe, your personal mathematics coach. Today I'm going to show you how to calculate a percentage. Now, what does a percentage mean? Per cent means of 100, meaning divided by 100. So, if you see 20%, that's the same as 20 divided by 100. If you see 90%, that's the exact same as 90 divided by 100. But sometimes we have to calculate the percentage. I'm going to show you three steps, easy three steps for you to calculate a percentage. The first step is, one, set up your fraction. The second step is convert your fraction to a decimal. And the third step is multiply your answer by 100. All right, at the beginning I told you that 19, or no, what did I say? I said 18 out of 20 people fear percentages. So that's how we set this up. 18, 18 is always the number that's a part of the entire amount. The entire amount in this case is 20. So our fraction would be 18 divided by 20. Now we're going to convert that to a decimal. This gets converted to a decimal by the first 18 goes inside and 20 goes on the outside of this division. Now 20 doesn't go into 18, so this is what we do. In order for us to divide this, we place a decimal here, a zero, and another decimal on top. Now we look at how many times does 20 go into 180? The answer is nine. We then subtract 180 and we're left with zero. So our decimal now is 0.9. Now 18 over 20 is the same thing as 0.9, but now we've got to make 0.9 a percentage. And there's an easy way to do that. We multiply 0.9 by 100. So 0.9 times 100 will give us a percentage. Now, if you remember math, which maybe you may not, this part may be a little confusing, but I'm going to make it easy for you. 0.9, when we multiply it by 100, is essentially changing the decimal space two places to the right. Our decimal would be now after 9, and it would be another space after 9, and we put a 0 here. So that would be the same as 90%. So 18 over 20 is essentially 90%. So hopefully right now, you can understand percentages and you be part of that 20% who loves percentages now. For more tips, go to my website, mathophobia.com. I am Olympia LaPointe.